48 PlayStation games have just received their play scores this August 2017. The play score is a standard rating that averages gamer and critic reviews. When a game only reaches the minimum requirement of critic or gamer reviews, it receives a provisional play score. 48 is Sudden Strike 4. With their fourth main installment, Sudden Strike returns us to the spectacles of the Second World War. Control the battlefield as the famed commanders of history and experiment with their varying playstyles. It's the biggest Sudden Strike title yet, and it receives a provisional play score of 6.31. 47 is White Day, a labyrinth named School. If there's two things Koreans are good at, it's probably Starcraft and horror. Join a pack of high school students as they explore a ghastly hallways of their haunted schools. Make your way out of the labyrinthine journey and survive the spine-tingling frights. It has a provisional play score of 6.65. 46 is Dino Frontier. Forming an unlikely mixture of prehistoric reptiles and the infamous American Frontier comes a Wild West tale like no other. It's Westworld and Jurassic Park combined as you build and manage your own settlements amid a backdrop of gigantic dinosaurs. Charming, but a little repetitive. It has a provisional play score of 6.65. 45th is Abduction. A spiritual successor to Myst and Riven, Scion's newest game sends us into the vastest of a fictional universe. Abducted from Earth by a mysterious alien race, explore the reaches of several lands and find your way back home. It has a provisional play score of 6.69. 44 is Warriors All-Stars. All things Koei Tecmo unite in one Ultimate Warriors reunion. Get a taste of their award-winning hacking slash action and play with over 30 different characters from the Koei Tecmo universe. It's a crossover you never knew you needed. It has a provisional play score of 6.88. 43rd is Last Day of June. What most indie games lack in budget and graphics, they make up for their immersive story and atmosphere. In Last Day of June, step into the shoes of a lovelorn Carl and uncover the story that's both sweet and tragic. It has a provisional play score of 7.24. 42nd is Graceful Explosion Machine. Vertex Pop makes their entrance to the PS4. Guide your graceful machine past narrow caves and fantastic colors as you fight against their swarm of geometric baddies. Fight them with blasters, sniper beams, and missiles in a glorious kaleidoscope battlefield. It has a provisional play score of 7.31. 41st is Comet Crash 2. Resist a looming alien invasion in this galactic tower defense. Play with friends to conquer their 50 campaign missions and head right into the multiplayer to test your skills against players around the globe. It receives a provisional play score of 7.39. 40 is Observer, a first-person cyberpunk psychological horror that's set in a dark futuristic dystopia. Play as a detective and member of a police unit named Observers and use your augmented vision to hack into people's fears. It received a provisional play score of 7.42. 39 is Chroma Gun. Ripping a page off of Valve's playbook, Pixel Maniac's Chroma Gun blends convincing puzzle mechanics with the quirks of lovable narrators. While it might look like a portal clone, it delivers enough originality to make up their own. It has a provisional play score of 7.43. 38 is Castle Storm VR Edition. Not your usual VR game. Castle Storm brings friendly medieval tower defense right before your eyes. Praise for its intuitive controls and massive amount of content. Choose your side in the ongoing battle for historical supremacy and take victory one match at a time. It has a provisional play score of 7.45. 37 is Spark. From the creators of the space combat simulator Eve Valkyrie, comes a daring virtual sports game. Set in a Tron-like neon cyber world, Spark urges you to use your body, throw, dodge, and block shots in this fun, family-friendly experience. It has a provisional play score of 7.48. 36 is Rock of Ages 2, Bigger and Bolder. The love child of Terry Gilliam and Besiege comes back for a second round of Boulder Destruction. Tickle your brain bits with their new tower defense tricks and bask in the joy of Monty Python absurdities. It has a provisional play score of 7.48. 35 is Kenfo Let's The Pillars of the Earth, the first chapter of Kenfo Let's legendary Kingsbridge series. Watch his world come alive as Daedalic Entertainment turns the captivating story of intrigue and gothic architecture into an interactive experience. It receives a provisional play score of 7.57. 
34 is The Long Dark. Explore Canada's icy wilderness in this one-of-a-kind survival game from Hinterland Studio. It's one of the most flesh-out survival games on the market right now. Scavenge for the tiniest morsels, stave off the bitter cold, and fight against the hungry predators. It has a play score of 7.6. 33 is Windjammers. Harken back to the Neo Geo games with the return of their beloved classic. Put on your best beach attire and get ready for some super-powered, disc-throwing action. With easy-to-learn controls, it's a perfect party game for friends of all ages. It receives a play score of 7.61 on the PS4 and a provisional play score of 7.59 on the PS Vita. 32 is Night Trap 25th Anniversary Edition. Another throwback entry but this time from the realm of full motion video games. Not exactly the best of its kind, but Night Trap earned its place in history thanks to the morality scares of the 90s. Get ready for a night of cheesy fun, because this game has a play score of 7.64. 31st is Cinemora X. Combining modern presentations, the thrill of classic shmups, and the franticness of time manipulation, Cinemora is anything but ordinary. Manipulate time through each of their stages, weave through its gorgeous story mode, and beat your high scores in arcade. It has a provisional play score of 7.8. 30 is Arc Survival Evolved. Enter a prehistoric paradise and bask in the perfect balance of beautiful landscapes and deadly reptiles. But this is no field trip. Create your base, gather resources, collect weapons, and turn yourself into a king among giants. It has a play score of 7.8. 29th place is Zero Escape Zero Time Dilemma. The PS Vita Classic makes its way to the big brother of Sony's collection. The final chapter to Spike Chunsoft's Zero Escape series Follow the tale of 9 people trapped in a deadly game. Can you save them all? It receives a provisional play score of 7.91. 28 is Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy Episode 3. The third episode of Telltale's newest licensed adventure. Roam around the galaxy with Marvel's greatest space heroes and help them uncover the secrets of an ancient artifact. With iconic locations and awesome tunes. It has a provisional play score of 7.96. 27 is Agents of Mayhem, a spin-off of the Saints Row series. Prepare for an open-world adventure in the heart of Seoul. Pick three agents from the eponymous organization and use their abilities to stop Legion from destroying their world. It receives a play score of 7.96. 26 is Minecraft Story Mode Season 2 Episode 2. Jesse and the gang come back for another season of laughs and misadventures. Returning home with a colossal new enemy, they embark into the Arctic weathers for more life-threatening decisions. It has a play score of 7.96. 25th is Thimbleweed Park. From the creators of Monkey Island and Maniac Mansion comes a thoughtful neo-noir mystery set in the dark glow of the late 80s. Roy Gilbert and Gary Winnick combine wits to bring us an absurd murder mystery in the style of a comedic Twin Peaks. It has a provisional play score of 7.98. 24 is Absolver. Adding to Devolver Digital Stylish Collection, Absolver puts you in the role of prospect to a group of elite fighters. Far from their usual pixel hits, this game showcases a gorgeous cartoon realism with its fluid yet punishing combat. It receives a play score of 8.04. 23rd is Madden NFL 18. Building upon the foundations of their previous titles, 18 comes with a brand new story mode that follows a Texan quarterback through his NFL journey. It also sprinkles a few of the usual visual and technical tweaks to bring it to its usual shine. It has a play score of 8.06. 22nd place is Matterfall. A follow-up to 2013's Resogun, Matterfall brings the side-scrolling shooter action to the PS4. It's a match made in heaven combining the platform jumping with the franticness of bullet hell. Survive the cities with augmented weapons and environment manipulating matter. It has a play score of 8.07. 21st is Batman The Enemy Within Episode 1. Telltale takes you to a dark and greedy Gotham with their newest license. With the return of the nefarious Riddler, help the Cape Crusader fight back against his evil tricks. Just like any Telltale game, you'll be faced with hundreds of important decisions. It has a provisional play score of 8.1. 20 is Mega Man Legacy Collection 2. Capcom's latest Mega Man collection brings together four of your favorite titles. 
This legacy pack will include a Mega Man 7 through 10, along with an array of new features like galleries, challenge modes, and so much more. It has a provisional play score of 8.15. 19 is Paranormal Activity The Lost Soul. Said it once, and we'll say it again. VR was made for horror. If you thought the movies were scary, then try immersing yourself in the inescapable horrors of this virtual haunted house. Put on your diapers because this might be the fright of your life. It has a provisional play score of 8.16. 18 is Lawbreakers. Defy gravity in this fast-paced first-person shooter that takes you to a futuristic world filled with explosive mayhem and tight suits. Shoot your enemies with your ballistic weapons and choose from a wide variety of characters. It has a play score of 8.17. 17 is Resident Evil Revelations. Originally released on the Nintendo 3DS, revisit the nightmarish monsters of the floating city in glorious HD. Packed with new content and all the DLC releases, it brings the definitive experience to the modern platforms. It has a play score of 8.22. 16 is Nidhogg 2. Venture to the worm once again and mesh off's odd looking game of duel. Use quick feints, slashes, and more, and destroy your opponents in 10 different maps. Bring your A game and jam to the game's amazing soundtrack. It has a play score of 8.22. 15 is City Skylines. One of the greatest achievements in the city building genre finally makes its way to the consoles. Take up the mantle of Mayor and bring a thriving mega city into the peak of efficiency. Handle traffic problems, create districts, and listen to the voice of your people. It has a play score of 8.38. 14 is Shadow Tactics Blades of the Shogun. Lurk in the shadows and practice the way of the ninja in this Edo-inspired tactical stealth game. Often compared to Commandos, the game is a polished gem with interesting character choices and well-implemented mechanics. It has a play score of 8.39. 13 is The Escapists 2. Following the success of their crowdfunded debut, The Escapist comes back to bring us more prison escape hijinks. While the visuals look better, the prisons are just getting harder. Play as a lowly inmate and devise your daring escape plan. It receives a play score of 8.49. 12 is Fishing Planet. If you thought fishing was just some boring thing dads do, then this game is here to prove you wrong. With realistic visuals, complicated AIs, and an impressive fish collection, Fishing Planet gives the sport the respect it deserves. It has a provisional play score of 8.54. 11 is Life is Strange Before the Storm Episode 1. Deck 9 serves fans of the critically acclaimed indie hit with a closer look at Chloe's troubled life. The first in a three-part series take a deep plunge into her mind, face a few difficult decisions, and weave through a tale of friendship and loss. It receives a play score of 8.61. 10 is Everybody's Golf, one of PlayStation's many mainstay titles. The game formerly known as Hot Shots Golf returns to their roots. Aside from their usual arcade action, their new features will let you play around in free roam, go online, and even customize your characters. It has a play score of 8.62. 9 is Yakuza Kiwami, a ground-up remake of the 2005 PlayStation game. Sega's Kiwami looks and feels fantastic with its re-recorded audio and enhanced visuals. Immerse yourself in new missions and 30 additional minutes of cutscenes. It's a classic Kiwami experience made better, and it receives a play score of 8.71. 8 is Players of Eternity Complete Edition, a throwback to the classic role-playing games. Obsidian and Paradox Interactive reunite once more to take you back into the world of Eora, along with everything you'll ever need to experience in full. Characters, expansions, and a bigger world. It's all here. It has a play score of 8.74. 7 is F1 2017. Codemasters Annual Formula 1 comes with a host of new improvements. Dive into a deeper career mode, join the enhanced multiplayer, enter the new championship mode, and gawk at their classic F1 cars. Live the Formula Racing dream because it has a play score of 8.84. 6 is Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice, a self-proclaimed indie AAA experience. Ninja Theory wows critics and gamers with this journey to the underworld. Help Senua fulfill her quest as she deals with a necrotic arm and her bouts of haunting psychosis. It's a landmark in emotional and sensory experiences, and it receives a play score of 8.88. 8. 
Fifth is Uncharted Lost Legacy. Looks like we don't need to worry about Nathan Drake's retirement. With her two badass girls taking the lead, then Naughty Dog's Uncharted series is in good hands. Retrieve a mysterious relic in another exciting adventure. It has a play score of 8.94. Fourth place is Sonic Mania. It snows Sonic Forces, but thankfully it's just as good. Zipping back to his pixel-perfect form helped the dashing hedgehog stuff another one of Dr. Robotnik's classic antics. It's the same side-scrolling platform with some new fresh additions. It has a play score of 9.03. Third place is Icy. An unexpected hit on Steam, the side-scrolling hack and slash also makes waves on the PlayStation. Between its Stanley Parable-esque fourth wall breaks and stylish combat, it's no surprise it reached success. Take down cyborg creatures and get drawn into its fast-paced world. It has a provisional play score of 9.09. .09. Second place is Undertale. Toby Fox's sleeper success finally hits the consoles. Play as a lost child as he navigates through a mysterious realm of monsters. Dedicated to a message of non-violence, the game is a morality-testing adventure with a jazzy soundtrack to boot. It has a play score of 9.24. And number one is Naruto Shippuden Ultimate Ninja Storm Trilogy. Now that the original series has reached its end, Masashi Kishimoto's legacy continues with Bandai Namco's Naruto Shippuden collections. Three of the previous Ultimate Ninja Storm titles packed into one Ultimate Collection. Relive the legendary adventure. It has a provisional play score of 9.39. You can get these games right now by clicking the link in the description box below.